So, I made my post about Gwendolyn being such a great friend. And my other great friend comes by and brings me a COVID test. And, oh my God, Crab Kings. Yes, 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 yes. Thank you, Chancy. I feel better already. You know, I'm going to be missing all the barbecues today because I'm so sick and cook out. So I will be eating this, taking this test. Let me take the test now to see if I'm good. But thank you so much, Chancy. Love you. You're an awesome friend. You really are. You have my back. You are um, selfless. You care about others, and you're just a good person. And I really appreciate that. She dropped it off of my door like, here you go. Bye. <laughs> but I don't want her to get my sickness, so thank you, Mother Tana Zappa. The gifts just keep on coming, my friends. I'm looking out. My friend Kimberly in New York, she sent me all this stuff to get better. Thank you so much. I've never had any of this stuff, so I'm going to try it. Um, well, the test came back. I do have COVID, so... That's why I've been feeling so bad. This has not just been a regular cold. So thank you so much. I can't go anywhere for a few days. You know, thanks. Appreciate you, Cam. Super nice. Hey, guys. So it turns out I tested positive for COVID. And um, I feel like um, I feel like I got it on the last. Maybe I picked it up the last night I was in L.A. or on the plane ride back. Because by Tuesday, I felt very lightheaded. I see Hollywood Unlocked picked up my post and reposted it. And I see the comments. I'm so ignorant that I got paid by the Democrats to push COVID. It's election time. <coughs> it's just a cold. You guys, my cousin died of COVID. And he was um early 50s. An otherwise healthy man. It was devastating to our family. And his sons and daughter were very devastated. Um... This isn't. This has nothing to do with the government. I I wish they gave me a check, especially since my show just got canceled. I would love it, but it's not the case. Just be careful. I'm. Just, I, there's no motive. I just wanted to let people know. Just remind you, just to be safe and wear a mask. I hate with the internet and social media that it just makes everyone just lose just manners and just decency, and, and no one wants to be polite. Like everyone just wants to like try to get a a, a, a joke off about everything. Everything's not a joke. Look at I feel like I look awful. Um, I just want y'all to just be aware. I mean, I know it never, quote unquote, went anywhere, but we, it wasn't front and center anymore. You know what I mean? Like we weren't, it wasn't something to really think about. It wasn't top of mind, front, front and center anymore. So just a reminder, you know, I had it early on when it first came out, early 2020 that I knew of. And never caught it again. I kind of felt invincible, like, oh, oh, I'm immune to it. And I'm not trying to push the jab at all. This is not what this is about. I actually am scared of the vaccine. But um, I just want y'all to just take extra precautions and, like, you know, like we used to.